Good morning, Britain. It's just gone half past six. Welcome to the programme, my first programme. Welcome to the programme, Ed Balls. How do you feel? Thank goodness you're here. <laughs> it's <laughs> so good to have somebody who knows what they're doing. I mean, you know, I've never... decided never... not to throw you into it on your own. Well, thank you. <laughs> I mean, I've never done this before, so it's exciting. A bit daunting. Yeah, uh, well, it's going to be very interesting and it's uh, it's lovely to have you here. So, nine o'clock tonight, we're watching Love Island. I also think it's the, the reason why it's such a unusually special programme is whatever you read in the papers, mm. it's only if you actually watch it and yeah. see the interactions and you really understand. Yeah. You know, I mean, it was only seeing Paige's face which made you understand the challenges she was having with Jack. I forgot, of course, how obsessed. It's not just that you watch, you actually are obsessed with Love Island. Yeah. You know, within the office of Valentine's Day moment, was that inappropriate, Jonathan? Not for me, mate. No. Uh, nor You're for me. You're not for anything. Ask Wayne is not for anything. Actually. But for some it might be. Can I say, it is our second Sex Pistol in a month or so, because we had Johnny Rotten on. Yes, of just course. in January as well. He was bidding to be the Irish Eurovision he Song was. Contest. He was. Didn't make it, but it was a great song. And now today, well... Because you're uh, quite an accomplished cook these They days. quite like my Yorkshire puddings. Oh. Yeah, well, there we are, yeah, yeah. They, and they were, they were quite surprised we have them with chicken as well as beef, but oh. that's, you know, the way it goes. Actually... You have got a Love Island suitcase, haven't you? Which, my... which you haven't just got in a cupboard somewhere. You use on a regular basis. <laughs> the Love Island suitcase with gets wheeled Aussie. around. It's been to um, to the south coast. It's right. been to southern Spain. While we do it, Ed is going to see how long it takes. Oh, I'm taking my tie off. For him to uh, strip the bed and remake it, because Ed says that he has once. Uh, at least once, changed bed sheets. <laughs> so um, uh, we're going to watch him while we talk to cleaning expert Lindsay Crombie. Who uh, eats lettuce in uh, February? Well, well, that is a Lots that is a good ate. point. Do they? Nice no, well, really what you Ed? I think she was mainly talking to me. Oh, was I thought. Yes, yes. I felt it was personal. I didn't hear her say Ed, but I... I know, I was waiting. <laughs> say it, I, I think say you it. were probably implied oh. throughout, definitely. You had yes. to kind of read between the lines. People will now write PhD theses on the Casa Amor effect. The egg, right? What are you talking about? Egg, listen to this. <laughs> it's uh, uh, young people get um, instantly turned off by men doing certain things. And it's, it can be anything. Right. Running, running for a bus and missing it. Egg. <laughs> No! Using the handrail going down an escalator. Ick. I, not, I neither understood That's the one. question or the answer. <laughs> it's uh, Christmas! Christmas. How did this happen? Um, it's still November. Do you know what? I think we just felt like we needed to get into the spirits of something festive, something celebratory. We were all last night, when the tiramisu moment came, when he shook the yellow cushion, Dammy came over. We punched the air and said, they've won it. That's the moment. That's the moment which is going to win it for Ekansu and Dammy. However, Danica. I think Danica is actually, you know... Really? I think she, I think, you know, she was in the, the, the last three, but I think Danica in the next couple of days, you know, I don't know, I think she's really, really cool and she's strong and she's been really persistent and I think the country out there loves her. Are we about to do karaoke? I think it must be a new Downing Street um, Is it a... to get him to go away. Alex. Done. Oh, it's Steve Bray. It's, it's not the Steve latest Bray. Steve Bray protest, oh my gosh. isn't it? Come on, Steve. Um, Come well, on, Steve. I suppose if you are no longer allowed to shout, yeah. there are other ways of making your voice heard. Anyway, we'll go we back to the studio. On, we? Well, I think we should go back to the studio. Okay,